Hey, what's happening guys? We are back again today with the Rui Dang DPS 5005 buck converter desktop power supply from our friends at Banggood and a piece of paper. It's because today we're going to get onto the unglamorous side of electrical engineering power supply characterization. We're going to check the efficiency and find out just how efficient this power supply is. Now I've looked through the manual here and they don't list the efficiency on there so we're going to figure it out ourselves it's not hard power in power out what's the difference percentage wise so we're giving it 30 volts in which is the maximum my bench top power supply can output uh, this thing here is monitoring the power in we can monitor the power out over here we've got a load you know we'll come down here we'll set our voltage start here at the bottom one volt we turn it on our power in is 0.3 watts our power out is 0.09 then we take it up to 2 volts our power in goes up to 0.9 our power out 0.39 up to 3 volts, power in becomes 1.5, out becomes 0.88. You get the idea. I'm not going to make you watch me do 30 of these, but I am going to do 30 of these. Then I'll be back and we'll talk about it. Alrighty then. Some time has passed, and unfortunately, we could not get above 25 volts because that's where my desktop power supply ran out of power so there's our information that we have now we're going to put it into the computer and see what she spits out all right so here's my uh characterization i know it's not complete but it's good enough for what we need to figure out we have input voltage, which is always a 30, output voltage from 25 down to 1, input power, output power, and efficiency. And then we have a graph here showing it, which the graph doesn't look that great, but when we come down here and average the overall, 86.01. 86.01. is okay. It's not great, it's not bad, it's okay. And that's about all we can say about that. So there you have it, about an 87% efficiency. Um, like I said, it's okay, it's not great, it's not bad, it's just kind of in the middle there somewhere, which is kind of what you'd expect. I mean, if you're looking for 98, 99% efficiency, you're gonna be paying a lot more than what you pay for this nice little compact unit and it does have a ton more features which we will get into at another time because that's it for today i hope you guys enjoyed if you did give me a thumbs up feel free to comment share don't forget to subscribe big thanks to all my patrons and another special thank you to dave from texas that's it i'm out peace Oh, <laughs>